Okay, I'm really going at these tonight. This is Flux by N. Kelly33, also known as Matthias. Uh, this is one of four wads that uh, was pointed to me that was submitted for a competition on a Czech retro game site called uh, High Voltage, high voltage.cz. So these were people new to uh, Doom Mapping who, who uh, wanted to give it a try. And uh, I'm going to I'm going to just uh, have a look at their efforts. This was all the way back in 2018, uh, but the the people on the site are hoping to revive the competition and uh, just get a little bit of interest back into it as well. So this one's interesting because obviously uh, hex and two textures, uh, which is unusual for Doom. Uh, I think this is hex and two music as well, possibly translated to MIDI. Um, so, definitely uh, getting the temptation to fall asleep immediately. <laughs> it's a shame, because this is a really nice uh, Egyptian texture set. It's a, a just slight, uh, slightly traumatic memories of playing through Hexen 2. Maybe you can do better things with this uh, Egyptian texture set than they could. Alright, so we've cleared out uh, our starting room. Although I do wonder if I even needed to go down there. Never mind, let's continue up. Alright, we've got a courtyard. And courtyards mean being able to be hit in the face by fireballs. I like the uh, I like the pillars here on the sides. There's uh, definitely a lot of detail gone into here. The torches in the middle of pillars as well. That's great. And straight into the double battle shotgun. Now, I've left some uh, shotgunners behind in there and uh, I'm in a wide open area so this is not going to go well for me. There we go. I'll have some of these please. Thank you. Ooh! Ow. So it looks a bit, uh, I can see it scrolling past as I circle strafe. There seems to be a, a large office building at the uh, other end of this courtyard. Hmm. This is a UFO that's uh, that the Egyptians have been working on. There are people that say that uh, the pyramids must have been built by aliens because uh, nobody on Earth realized that the most easy way to pile up stones in a shape is to do it in the shape of a pyramid. Interesting use of some uh, stock Doom 2 textures here. They're unusual, but uh, I didn't have difficulty telling what the game was trying to trying to tell me with them. Mm. Sorry, this is going to be a fairly boring exchange. <laughs> there he goes. Oh, he, where did he come from? Oh, 
I only got six shells left, uh, so I'm not in a great position here. Will this correct it at all? No. Definitely not. Um. What now? Oh, okay. So this this lava doesn't hurt, which is, uh, to be honest, welcome. But uh, you'd expect this to be a damaging floor. Um, and these big platforms with all the lights look a bit strange. I would expect lights, you know, maybe on the corners and then another metallic texture or Egyptian texture uh, to fill up the rest of the block. There's large grids of textures that obviously repeat uh, are probably to be avoided. I do like the exteriors here as well. That's a not just a flat surface. You've got uh, you've got some obelisks. You've got uh, a, I'm supposed to read something way up there, um, and these columns outside here as well. Oh. Whoa. Someone peeking out from behind the pillar. There was a hell die here, wasn't there? I'm dead. Oh, okay. And we're going to live. No traps evident, okay. Is this going to be one of those maps where I have to collect all three keys and then uh, come back to the center? Oh, maybe not. Interesting door. Wow, look at this. What do I have to do to... Do I have to step in here? Oh, good! Sorry, not good. I mean, oh god. Now, that that's kind of unfair, because uh, the player doesn't have any cover at all. Well, he's got cover here, I suppose, or you could just run. But yeah, I would, uh, I would definitely expect to have... Uh, at least some fighting chance of uh, defeating the Archvilles without getting hurt. Uh, maybe you could put some pinkies in there and have a pillar in the center uh, so the pinkies chase them, but you've got the option. Alternatively, am I just supposed to guess which one's right? And then just go into the one that uh, isn't wrong. And uh, this is the last one, I think. Now we've got um, we've got a collection of enemies in each one. Uh, so I I don't really know what that's about. Unless there's a switch in one of them. Oh, there's switches in all of them. <sighs> Here we go. You can just uh, populate yourselves. I'm glad that no monsters are coming through the teleport with me. Uh, which one have I not been in now? Yeah. There we go. Beat the challenges, or <laughs> in some way, in some manner of uh, beating the challenges, and we're out. It's an interesting idea, but you can't just run past everything. I would probably make them a little more varied 
and have uh, different arena shapes and different challenges rather than them all just having the same kind of environment. Ah! My cavalier attitude has uh, come back to bite me, finally. Or, actually, that was the demon. Where are you? Oh, something's fallen on my desk and I can't move the mouse anymore. <laughs> Hang on. There we go. All fixed. Okay. Got plenty of ammunition by now. Look at all of them. Might be better to just uh, let them finish themselves off. Uh, but I do have this, and it'd be a shame not to use it, wouldn't it? I saw that. I saw that archvile. Let me at them. There we go. How about you? Okay. And by the way, don't think I didn't notice the bloody nine tiles puzzle. Sorry, I pressed the wrong button. The architecture in this map's really nice. It's, uh, you know, it it's kind of square, but you'd expect that in a pyramid. And uh, there's there's all these kind of details, all these uh, sarcophagi and the in and outy uh, parts. It, nothing's nothing's left just as a cube. You can do it with a bit more variety in here, because uh, both sides of the pyramid are the same. Oh, I didn't. Uh, I didn't see all the other teleporters. It didn't try the others in, in that side. What's this do? Okay, that raises half of that platform. What about this one? And what? About... Which ones have I gone in? Are they all the same? They are, okay. It's less confusing to have just one uh, destination per teleport. One teleport per destination. It doesn't seem to be necessary to... Uh, it doesn't seem that it... Sorry, I'm... I'm, <laughs> I'm repeating all the starts of my sentences. It doesn't really make sense to have multiple teleports going to the same place. And it's confusing for the player as well. Whoa, okay. So that's given us passage into the UFO, hasn't it? And is that... Oh, I've, I've, I've gone more colorblind than normal, but that is the end. That was nice, definitely, especially considering this is, you know, people's first try at doing a map. Uh... 
Some parts were kind of repetitive when you made them symmetrical. I think that's why uh, it's better to avoid symmetry in Doom maps, because it makes things predictable. It also makes things uh, more difficult to navigate. Um, the challenges out in space on the platforms was also a nice idea, but I would definitely vary them a bit more, rather than just having different monsters in every one of them, trying to make the terrain suited to the monster, uh, or rather suited for the monster to uh, attack a player. Uh, but overall, very nice attempt at the first map. And uh, I do hope that this uh, competition gets going again. It's uh, high voltage, high-voltage.cz. I'll do a three more of them.